Hi everybody, it's Tuesday with Tuesday's Fun Finds. How are you today? I hope you're doing well. Thank you for joining me. Today we have another purse sale. I'm glad you're here and we're just gonna hop right into it. We're gonna start off with the smallest purse or make our way up to the largest, or at least I think I am. Anywho, the first one we're gonna start off with is this adorable petite uh, fossil crossbody. It has one interior zipper pocket. Oh, I just opened it and closed it. Super cute. I love it. And let me get you a measurement. So let me know if you guys are enjoying the purses or if you prefer jewelry. Um, that way I have an idea of what you guys are more interested in or if you just like a combination That's fine, too. I don't mind it All right, so this is um, eight inches By we're gonna say I'm gonna say six and a half And then we'll measure the strap because the strap again is not adjustable so that's 24 inches long, the, the strap is, or the drop, strap, drop. So this purse, I'm gonna be asking 16. Again, if you're interested in anything today, you can email me at TuesdaysFunBinds at gmail.com. I'll send you a PayPal invoice through an email the invoice will include the price of the purse along with the um, shipping charge. So shipping is not included, that's separate. All right, the next purse is this one. This is actually a new with tag purse. Claremonte Accessories. This has got like a woven look. Um, and I would say that this is a leather woven um, over a canvas. Has this awesome denim blue strap with a coral trim. There's no exterior pockets. There we go. Has a, the main compartment is a zipper. The interior is very clean because again, I don't think this purse was ever used. It still has its original tags. Very clean. And it's got um, the gold hardware with these pretty colors, coral green, blue, give you a measurement it's hard to measure it when the stuffing's not in there so we're gonna say I'm gonna say nine and a half by approximately eight and then of course the strap is adjustable and I'm asking sorry I can't find it okay so I'm asking $30 for this purse Okay, the next bag we're gonna go with this more of a travel style purse bag. Um, this brand is called Hedgren. I think that's how you pronounce it. Oops, sorry guys, let me, there we go. It's um, got a nylon material. Hedgren Urban Bags. All right, so on the outside we have, we're gonna call this the front. There's one zipper pocket on the outside. Okay, slot for your phone. There's some packaging um, gels or whatever, anyways. Okay, and then on the back side, 
There's another zipper pocket. So plenty of space to get organized. The main compartment is also a zipper pocket. These are the packaging gel things. There's an interior zipper pocket. Of course, this would be, this would wash up very nice because of it being nylon. The strap is adjustable. Let me show you. The strap is adjustable. Really a neat little travel bag or for everyday use, whichever you prefer. Let's get some measurements. Um, let's see here. We're going to say 10 and a half. And I'm going to go to the middle of the purse. Well, I'm going to go from here. So uh, we're going to say 10. And then, of course, the strap is adjustable. I mean, there's a few areas that just have, like, some, you know... But overall, very good condition. And I'm going to ask 15 for that purse. Travel bag. Pretty red. So, number four, I think we're going to go with this one back here. This is a gray Stone Mountain crossbody. Silver hardware. This is the front of the purse. Has one small zipper pocket in the front with some really cool interior, but I'm gonna show you that when we get into the bigger section. That way it's easier to show. Stone Mountain. There's a few areas, and actually I may hit them with some conditioner, and I bet you that they, they will be just fine. Okay, the back of the purse. We have a zipper pocket. Pretty cool interior, slip pocket. The main compartment opens up a zipper too. The packaging. All right, is this interior not, let me pull it out. Not awesome sauce. Look at this beautiful green interior. Genuine leather shell polyester okay so we have one two three slipper pockets and a zipper pocket pretty 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 very nice condition gray the strap is adjustable and the strap seems to be in excellent condition as well pebble soft pebble leather I don't know if I, yeah, I did show you the bottom. Okay, so let's get some measurements. All right, that's 12 inches. By, we're going to say nine and a half, 10. And then of course, like I said, the strap is adjustable crossbody. And I'm going to be asking 25 for that purse. Okay, purse number five, I'm gonna grab for this one. This is a sack, the sack. I picked this up at Goodwill last week, I believe it was. So we're gonna call this the front of the bag. Um, this is kind of like a crackled leather this is soft um, but it's like a crackled leather like a rustic look um down here oops sorry says the sack okay so we're gonna call this the front it has a zipper pocket one side pocket 
this is actually not a full closure, just a, like a design piece of leather closure. Might as well go to the other side, same thing. Now this side does have a few pen marks right here, if you can see that. Nothing major. A slip pocket in the back. I like these um, X's, adds to the rustic look of this bag. The bottom, clean, clean, clean. All right, and then we've got the two shoulder straps. And then it opens up zipper pocket, or zipper closure, zipper opening. Now there is in the bottom of this some pen marks on the um, fabric there down at the bottom, you can see. Um, but we have a two pockets, slip pockets, a zipper pocket. There it says the sack. Very pretty. Oh, and I almost forgot. Okay, so then two, each side has a slip pocket. One on each side of the main section. Let me measure this for you. All right. Um, well, we're just going to go from side to side. That's how I've been doing it. We're going to say 15. By, we're going to say nine and a half. Oh, and then the drop strap is 10. I'm going to be asking $30 for this bag. Okay, second to last, I think we're going to pick this Hobo International. Hobo International bag. Again, it's kind of got that um, crackled, rustic leather look. We're gonna call this the front of the bag. It's got a side zipper pocket. And stuff whatever you want down in there. going to go to what we're going to call the back of the purse and it has a magnetic closure slip pocket so that's nice okay and then the center compartment is also zipper closure interior, the floral. We have a zipper pocket along with a slip pocket. There's a little bit of wear there up here. Signs of wear I should say. On the other side on the interior, slipper, slip, two slip pockets. Very deep purse. The strap looks really good. Show you some of the hardware. Okay, let's get you a measurement. All right, this measure is 14. by 11 and a half and the drop strap is 10.
okay. And I'm going to be asking 30 for this bag. Really cute. All right, guys. Last bag coming up. And it's my favorite. I found this at a Goodwill. And I had to bring it home. It is in, to me, excellent condition. It's a Dooney and Burke bucket purse. I mean, really, 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 really nice condition. I honestly don't know if this has ever been really used that much. Now I did condition it, clean it up real good. Push this button to get into the purse. Let me lift you up just a little bit. There we go. So there it's locked. And you push this little side lever. And then you can get into the inside of the purse. The interior looks great. Actually, I can pull it out because there is some ink marks, so I want to be sure to show you. So there is an ink mark there. Here's the Dunienberg tag. There's an ink mark here. But other than that, there is a zipper closure on the inside. I'm trying to get that to show up real good. Let me try this. There we go. No? There. <clears throat> oh, and then there's a key holder Hook for your keys. Absolutely beautiful purse. And I will be asking $60 for this purse. Let's get some measurements. I think I'll do it this way, maybe easier. All right, we're going to say that that is 11 and a half. By, we're gonna say nine. Just to give you an idea, the bottom measures, we're going to say five and a half by eight. And then the strap drop, we're going to say is nine. Gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Again, this one is 60. Okay, everybody, so that concludes our purse sale for today. Thank you for joining me again at my kitchen island. Um, if you're interested in anything, you can email me at TuesdaysFunFinds at gmail.com. Please send me the inter item that you're interested in along with your name and shipping address and I will shoot you over a PayPal invoice. And the invoice will include the price of the purse along with the shipping charges. Um, and thanks again for joining me. I'll see you next week. Please like, comment, subscribe, click the bell. That way you're notified when I load another video and make it a good one. Thanks, bye.